Hi, this is Steve from SewingGold.com. Um, this is a Seiko STH8BLD-3. You cannot tell because you're looking at the underside of the machine. Um, so I've tilted the machine back to expose the underside. Uh, one of our customers is having a problem uh, getting too much oil to the hook assembly. And we want to reduce that by tightening, or yeah, tightening this screw here. It's hard to see, and I'm going to zoom in now so you can see it. Okay, so this screw in the center here is what we want to tighten. So we need to loosen the nut and tighten the screw. So I'm going to grab a seven millimeter wrench. And loosen that. All right, once that's loosened, uh, you're going to want to grab an Allen wrench or a hex key, I'm not sure what size. I'm going to find out right now. That's way too big. There you go. So I'm going to want to tighten that. Now, you're going to have to play around with this. You don't want to tighten it too much. Um, sorry for my... I'm zoomed in so much it's really hard to see what, what I'm actually doing here. So I'm putting the Allen wrench in here, tightening it. So tightening it, of course, is righty-tighty. Uh, lefty is loosey. So we want to go righty-tighty to the right. Uh, we're going to tighten that up uh, so that will limit the amount of oil. It's going to, like, pinch this hose and then the, uh, the actual rope that's inside here that's uh, picking up the uh, oil from the oil reservoir that is right here. So what you want to do, like I said, was um, loosen the nut, tighten the screw. Okay, once you tighten the screw, then you want to tighten that nut back up. Okay, so you tighten that nut back up and then check it out because you don't want to limit the oil where it's going to be zero oil to the hook assembly. Otherwise, you can get, you know, lock the machine up. So just tighten it ever so slightly. I don't have an exact amount because uh, this is the first time I've ran into that problem before. Um, so that would be one way to limit the oil to the hook assembly. Um, so if you have any questions or comments, leave them below. Uh, hopefully you understand what I just did there. Um, if you have any questions, uh, please, like I said, leave a message below. Thank you.